Mm, what is that intoxicating scent you have on? What? It's a... Oh, wait a minute. No. It's a snuggle. <laughs> I love her. You know Fran Drescher from her funny roles on TV, The Nanny. But when it comes to fighting cancer, she is serious. She is focused. She actually founded a group, Cancer Schmancer, and she's getting ready for a big health summit. It's coming up next week. And Fran is here. Welcome. Thank you. Happy to be here. I, I love the whole idea behind this. You don't take it very seriously, and yet it is a, a, a very serious issue to you because well, you're a survivor. I don't think it's that we don't take it seriously. I think cancer schmancer means cancer is not the boss of me. Mm -hmm. So we're very empowering, and we're not morbid. We're fun, and we're an education-based prevention, early detection, and policy change organization. So we're putting power back into the patient, transforming them into medical consumers, and turn, turning them into a very proactive, less scared, um, more engaged with a game plan, because over 90% of cancer is environmentally stimulated. We have to make those connections. We have to understand the early warning whispers in our body because inflammation is the beginning, mm -hmm. cancer is the end. So we have to start tuning into inflammation. We also have to realize that, um, you know, we can put off those early warning whispers, not make that doctor's appointment, but at the end of the day, that's when it's most curious. Catch it on arrival, 95% survival. Ooh, and I we're useless that. to our family <laughs> if we're six feet under. So this is all the stuff, and we're planning to blow people's mind. Whoever comes and buys tickets on the 26th to the Skirball Cultural Center, we have so many fantastic speakers and panel discussions. Ed and Begley, of course food. Mary Lou Henner, yes, Doc, my Mackenzie doctor, Dr. Phillips. Christy Funk. Cr Great doctors are coming, all different kinds of doctors, from the extreme alternative options to uh, more traditional Western. We're going to give you the full spectrum, and we plan to transform you from patient into medical consumer. We're covering all family health and well being. That includes men's issues, because one out of two men are anticipated to get cancer in their lifetime. Kids, because kids are the first generation today anticipated not to live as long as their parents. Parents. So there's a lot to look at, a lot of environmental I issues that are actually aggravating our poor health. And I think that when you leave there, you're going to think, okay, I got a game plan. I know how I'm going to engage my family. I know what I need to do. I feel less helpless, less impotent, um, more involved. And I also want to remind people that we as consumers mm -hmm. have a lot of power and what we use what we buy is purchasing power and we can actually dictate manufacturing trends without waiting for policy to change in Washington uh, just because they want to sell us and they'll sell us whatever we're willing to buy which right now is anything so we're getting a lot of toxins each and every day right. it's about what we put in our body what we put on our body what we surround ourselves exactly with. in on and around you thanks for knowing that <laughs> and I love the, that you talk about at, at the summit treating the whole person not just the disease right. it's about mental health it's about emotional spiritual Correct. health and you're going to address all that at the same mind time. body spirit you know we have to stop fragmenting uh, i think western medicine and reductionist medicine has focused on a particular part of your body that seems sick but it's never just that part there's a whole system involved in a very complex you know human being and then inclusive with that it's how are we feeling every day? How are we living our lives? Are we living in stress? Are we living in wisdom? Mm. Are we living in kindness and compassion and generosity and gratitude? Or, you know, are we so bogged down with the pressures of our lives and trying to keep up with the Joneses and trying to do this and that, that we forget to look up at the beautiful sky? And say thank you, and, right? Exactly, and say thank you indeed. It's, it's going to be a great day. Thank you for being here. Thank I you. feel better already. Uh, <laughs> well, you could go to cancerschmancer.org. Even if you can't make it, you could get your tickets there, but you can also learn so much. Join yeah, the movement. Great videos. Figure out that. how to detox your home. We teach you everything. Everything.
Fran, thank you. Thank you. All right, Cancer Schmancer, the summit. It's Wednesday, 11 to 4 at the Skirball, Skirball Cultural Center. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's the laugh you were waiting oh. for, right? For more information about the event and to get tickets, just go to kcal9.com, click Scene on TV.